Hello everyone, welcome to Logic News and I'm Gaurav and we are learning about the Bootstrap version 4, okay, about the latest version of Bootstrap release. So uh, now in this video we are going to uh, include the components of our uh, Bootstrap, of our website from the Bootstrap, okay. So first component we, in this video we are going to talk about is our, uh, the navigation bar, okay. So we had this page over here and we have this template over here, saved over here and Everything is just saved into this uh, Bootstrap folder. We link it uh, using the Bootstrap classes since uh, we had two such classes uh, already. Okay, so now we are going to include the navigation. So how we can go and include the navigation? We can just go to the Bootstrap guide here right now, and we can just go to the navs, or you can go to the nav bar. Okay, so uh, here uh, everything is given, every style of and every changes. Are given but uh, for a quick change uh, for a quick installation you can just go and I would uh, take the type of the navigation you wanted to okay so if you wanted uh, the such of type navigation you can just go and copy the slice of code from here and you can just go and paste it over here okay so now you can go and test your website and you have a simple little uh, looking line over here and because there's no textual contents over here you can just uh, you can see there's no no content on this navigation you can see just a line like things okay, but if you include something like home or anything okay then you can see there is something called as home and the navigation is looking fine now okay so you can uh, display the navigation as you wanted to upside or down uh, like Whenever you wanted uh, to make the navigation upside, okay, then you can go and replace it like this. And we need to delete this actually. Fine, so our navigation, uh, the basic navigation is up now, and we are going to include the components of the navigation. So now I'm going to talk about how to uh, use and modify the navigation system, the navigation uh, classes of the uh, navigation, okay, navigation and bootstrap. So everything, the most important thing in the navigation system and everything in the, in every uh, divisions of uh, bootstrap is this particular thing, the classes of the bootstrap. So if you are uh, familiar with bootstrap, maybe uh, there are few changes in the bootstrap 4, but most of the things are likely same, okay. So uh, we are going to now go into this particular thing and just we are going to include this particular line of code because this includes all the, almost all the components that we need into our navigation system. This particular uh, code over here, we are, going, we are going to replace it. Okay, fine. Okay, so now let's go and test it out. And now we have a gray looking, uh, light uh, gray looking uh, navigation system here, but we wanted it a dark one. Okay, so for that, what we need to do, we just only need to change this line of code width as we checked our dark one had this particular class over here. We can go and just take it and just replace it right here okay so this is uh, this is as simple as we do in other things and the, this the simplicity of bootstrap that you can just go and change the class and whatever you want it to do you can just change it out fine so this is our simple navigation system here over here and the other thing the one component that we need to we want to include in our navigation is the drop down okay the drop down is one very uh, interactive, interesting, attractive and everything is included with it. Everyone wants the drop down menu when, while building a big website. So we are going over down over here, okay. And you can go or you can just go over here and you can just go to the navs. Okay. So all the, the drop down things are over here and uh, you can search for the drop down. Yeah. We have a code for drop down here. Fine. So this is how the drop down looks like. So we are going to uh, look into it. This is the class. This is the line for the drop down, and you can go just go and include it somewhere over here. Okay, inside this UL class, inside this unlisted list. So now you can go and refresh your page. And you can see uh, this nice looking drop down menu is right here with your page. Okay. 
Now let us go and check the response because uh, Bootstrap is actually uh, built and actually uh, working for the for developing the most responsive website over the internet. It's okay, that is compatible with everything, uh, mobile, laptops, and everything. Right? So over here, when you go back, you can just see that all these things called the stuff. Okay, everything is just messed up with everything. So now we are going to uh, get things proper and sudden. Um, proper over here and right now we wanted that uh, there is a class in bootstrap while you turn the screens in such a way or using the mobile or tablet okay then there is a class in the bootstrap that we can use and that is the collapse one okay so for that you need to go into the um, navbar again and you need to just click here the collapsible content okay and for that you can come over here you can just go check this out uh, copy this page content okay and you can just go and replace this out from here the whole navigation system fine so now you can go and test your website how it looks like and you can see the navigation system got changed because we copied all the lines of code and everything uh, over there so we need to just go and copy this particular class now bar dark bj inverse copy it up and paste it right over here okay okay so everything is like that only now and but what got changed is that when you get into the li um, low width screen okay low width browser then you will get this particular button over here and you will get the responsive website uh, getting the drop down like this okay so this is the collapsible uh, class of the navigation inside the bootstrap fine the next thing inside this you can just go and include some things like uh, if you wanted to include uh, menu written over when it's got collapse you can just go and write it like that okay over here and when you finish it you can check there's a menu and this is how it's getting down okay you can also get go and uh, just add the drop down like we added before okay so it was over here i think it is here so we are going to paste it right down here and then go refresh it you can test the drop down is working fine so this is all about uh, the elements of navigation bar inside the bootstrap you can use and design whatever you want it to and however it looks like okay so this is all about navigation system we will go and refine this navigation system more into our later lectures but right now we are going to build a complete structure of a simple structure of a website in bootstrap so in next tutorial we are going to talk about more components and more parts of a website to um, bootstrap for this video uh, this much is okay and meet me in the next video to learn more and build more okay so thank you for watching and please don't subscribe uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video thank you